Yeah. What's the story behind this dude, then? It's all faded so badly, you just don't know. Hmm. But look, he's got a cane, that's faded, but he's holding a cane going down there, like vaudeville cane. We've been with time dancing the area, as I say, for at least 40 years which is nothing compared to the connection that we have with this church that we discovered a few years ago. Uh, according to the records, your parish records, back in 1561, there was a donation made by the church warden to the Morris Bells, which makes it probably the earliest reference to Morris dancing in Sussex, and maybe even in the country. Uh, unless you know, unless you know better. But it seems very appropriate to actually re emerge this tradition and speaking to Father, uh, Father Stephen that uh, a small donation can be made by you to this year's apprentice belts. We have one of our apprentices here today. Uh, Rob is here taking photographs for us. Uh, and uh, we will be very happy have a small donation to the cost of the Morse Bells for this season's apprentices. Welcome to your birthday. Yes, always. Not long to go though. <laughs> <laughs> Speech, Martin. I use every opportunity. <laughs> Never let one pass. You didn't notice you pulled the top off the mic, did you? Know? I hadn't noticed. I wasn't well, so um. The, your I peas were it, popping yeah. after you did that. My, your peas were popping. My peas were popping. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going to say. I think the, the issue is you're not high enough. Yeah, I keep it. Yeah, you keep that one. No, I'm going to off one down. Yeah, I keep it. Did you have two of these? I keep it. 
Is it the same bell that the prop uses? Uh, and they, they, it uses the tenor. Strikes the tenor. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Well, that was fun. That was brilliant.